Welcome back to NBA Cinema. So we're going to talk about the incident on NBA TV where it got a little crazy between Chris Miles and Sam Mitchell. And Sam Mitchell really went in, started leaking the man's address and everything. We're going to get into it. I ain't going to talk your head off before we play the clip, but I'm going to react to it uh, at the end. Let's check it out. Hey Sam, what do you think about the fact that Steve Curtis is going to be as head coach? Yeah, I saw that. The coaches, the coaches don't get the medals, I guess. It just tells you what the what, international, how they value coaches. Not at all. I'm surprised. <laughs> how the coaches don't get a gold medal? I'm surprised coaches get a paycheck for this show. You know, I, I think, like, maybe you should do this pro bono, my friend. You know, <laughs> I, last time I looked at my check, it's pretty close. So, hey, I'm taking donations. Why don't you come up off some of that money you got since you're over there bragging about it? <laughs> I'm not bragging about well, it. Well, I mean, yeah. Oh, oh, I'm sorry. Did you rent your beach house out down in Florida during the hurricane? Or do I need to go on? How about your townhouse over, over at Buckhead? Hey, what's going on here, you, Sam? You want to call me out? I mean, come on. I think you we screaming have... broke and hungry. Let's just see it. <laughs> you know, I know I know what you're having where you live, young fella, so you need to stop. I think we have snitches on the show today. No, we don't have snitches. We have Sam truth tellers. Mitchell. We have truth tellers. So you're the one who crying poor and destitute up here when... Do I need to keep going on further, more and more? Or do you want me to stop right now? Go to this game between That's the Sacramento what I Kings you do. I and told the you, Golden young fella, State Warriors. You're going to stop messing with me on national TV. I done told you about that. Hey, do I need to give out the address? Because you're not at home right now. Warriors rich in history of championships and now an Olympic gold medal. Florida, huh? You had the pool put in yet? I think that's your house. No, that's your house, Chris. Oh, that's your rental property house. There we go. All right, Warriors. Boy, this game can't, can't tip fast enough. We'll be you. back at halftime <laughs> and after the game as well. <laughs> so a couple things stand out when I listen to that. Um, Sam Mitchell says, you're going to stop playing with me on national TV, young fella. So this isn't the first incident or even a second where he felt defended. This seems like a thing that maybe even has been discussed behind the scenes before, but uh, this guy says things that obviously offend Sam and feels like he's trying to play his face in front of a national audience and you know, he just reached his ticking point today. Uh, but man, he started leaking addresses and you know, where he stayed, a beach house, and, and maybe he didn't say exactly where it is, but now you can Type in Chris Miles at House Atlanta. You could everything's on Google, so that's enough information to give people a starting point to know what city he's in. So, um, yeah, you never talk about someone's finances on TV. You know that that's one thing you don't do, and, and Chris Miles should know better than that. You know what I'm saying? That's gonna offend pretty much anybody. Uh, you know, you're trying to call somebody broke, basically. You know, saying you I feel like you should do this pro bono and all that. Any pro bono, the only thing you're going to be doing or catch anybody doing like that is in a soup kitchen or something like that. But if I have to come to a job at a certain time every day, then I need my money for it. You know, when they start, uh, my, my time is allotted to be there at certain times. You know, I, I got to get paid for that every time. Um, But yeah, Chris Miles, man, he went off on the deep end and. Sam Mitchell, you know, he dove head first uh, off of the deep end and started calling him out. It was very uncomfortable. You could hear the nervous laughter. You could hear them even still talking about it when they came back from commercials. So hopefully he learned his lesson and hopefully Sam isn't reprimanded too bad for this because Sam does a good job over there on NBA TV. And it also makes me wonder, uh, as like Isaiah Thomas, Steve Smith, some of those guys, have they had some of the same... Um, things to say, you know, as far as uh, Chris Williamson, you know, I mean, Chris, Chris Miles, you know, I wonder, uh, has the NBA Brotherhood talked about it as far as like some of the things he says on air or whatever, but yeah, man, let me know what you guys think in the comments. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to next time. Peace.